everyone. Welcome to our community outreach podcast. My name is Ana Isadame, Health Promotion Specialist. And today I am with Woodbury County Outreach Coordinator for Hawkeye, Rosa Downs Lupercio. Welcome, Rosa. Hi, thank you. Do you want to tell us a little bit more about yourself and how long you've been with the health department? Um, so I've been with the health department for eight years. I've been the Hawkeye Outreach Coordinator for Woodbury County for approximately six or seven. Um, I, I love it. Yeah, good. Um, so tell us a little bit more about Hawkeye. What is Hawkeye? So Hawkeye is um, health insurance for medium income families. It's um, part of um, the whole Medicaid program is uh, like a sister. It is uh, for people that make more money for um, a pl- to qualify for Medicaid, uh, but it is for children under 19. Okay. Um, that don't have any health insurance. So only children under 19 qualify for health Correct. Okay. And what services are covered? It covers um, medical, it covers medications, doctor visits, it covers hospital services, prescriptions, ambulance services, emergency care, vision, dental, chiropractor, medical, uh, mental health, substance abuse, um, well child visits. It's very, very um, complete coverage. Good. What doctors except Hawkeye in the area do you know? Uh, Most doctors in the tri-state area cover um, uh, except Hawkeye. Um, Hawkeye has the same um, uh, insurances that Medicaid do, which is Amerigroup and Iowa Total Care. Um, All you would have to do is call your um, medical provider and ask him if they are accepting Hawkeye. Most um, clinics do accept Hawkeye. So would you say that if they accept Medicaid, they accept Hawkeye? Most likely, yes. Okay. But what if your child really only needs dental coverage? That is an option as well. Um, If you, if your child has private insurance through your work, um, it, but doesn't have dental or their dental, it's a uh, minimum and needs more dental coverage. There is an option for Hawkeye dental only. Um, you would just have to meet the requirements and, um, that is a- another option, Hawkeye dental only. And it covers the same as any other dental insurance. It covers fillings, um, checkups, um, most of the treatments done. It does have limited for orthodontics, but definitely um, check it out. Now, are these services, the Hawkeye services, are they free? It just depends. Um, it's based on your income, just like Medicaid. Um, if you're if you're over the income guidelines for Medicaid and they transfer your child for um, Hawkeye, it'll be based on your income. If um, there's a possibility that Hawkeye could be free, either the full Hawkeye medical and dental or dental only as well as the same. Um, It could be that you might have to pay $10 premium a month, $20, the most a family would pay would be $40. And that would be per family, not per child. So you could have five children within the Hawkeye system, but only pay $40 a month or only pay $20 a month. Hawkeye has no co-pays and no out-of-pocket expenses. Okay. Where would they find the income guidelines? Do you know? Um, you can go to the DHS office um, and get, sorry, and get the, um, the income guidelines. You can call me if you have questions. You could also go on the website to the DHS uh, portal, Iowa DHS, and you can find it there too. You can also go into the Siouxland District Health Department website. I also have a, a, a the guidelines there too. Okay. And so how does one go about applying for Hawkeye services? There's several ways you can apply. You could either um, pick up the the paper application at DHS office. You would apply like you're applying for Medicaid um, and then Medicaid will will sort it out and then send you um, to Hawkeye. Or you can call me, I can schedule an appointment, I can help you with the application. You could also go online on the, um, give me one second, dhs.iowa.gov website, and you can apply there as well. Okay. So what if someone's private insurance is ending, what can they do to transition? 
So let's say your insurance through your work is either too expensive, your child needs more services and are not covered, and you really don't know what to do. Um, open enrollment is coming up. You could also, um, if you don't want to reapply for the private insurance because it's hard for your family, you could call me and we can help you through that transition. We would apply for your child. We'll tell you how to apply and when to apply um, because it's only for kids that don't have insurance. So it would be you apply right before mm -hmm. the end the end of the coverage through your private insurance, and um, we will help you with the transition. So your child would have um, Hawkeye if approved as of the beginning of the year or at any time. If, if you happen to lose your job, um, then just give us a call. We can help you. Right. If someone lost the job, they wouldn't have to wait until open enrollment. They could apply. Correct. Because um, otherwise, if you apply while your child is still covered under private insurance, they'll give you the dental um, only because Hawkeye is only for kids that don't have private insurance. Right. Um, so if your job is ending and their coverage is going to end, you can apply at any time. If you have any questions, don't know what to do, always call us. Yeah. We can help you out. Is there anything else you would like to add or think people should know? Um, it, even if you don't know if you qualify, it's, it's um, Hawkeye is very extensive. Um, a family of four can make up to almost $84,000 a year and the children would still qualify. A family of five, you can make up to 98,000 a year. It's very accessible and it's a, a great program is based on the needs of children. And um, if you think you may qualify, you're not sure, give me a call. I can always help you out to find out if you do. Definitely, yep. And then um, remind them of your contact information. My phone number is 712-224-5424. Okay, thank you, Rosa. Thank if you have you. any questions, just give us a call, give Rosa a call if you would like to know more about the program and we will see you next month with our next podcast. Thank you. Thank you.